A familiar face from Cincinnati jumping into statewide politics. Congressman Jim Renacci has picked Cincinnati City Council member Amy Murray as his running mate. Local 12's Anjanette Levy is here with why the pair believes they have the winning ticket. Anjanette. Well, Paula and Brad, Jim Renacci has been in Congress since 2011, but he says he and Amy Murray are actually outsiders, and he believes their business experience will set them apart from other Republicans in the race. Renacci represents an area that surrounds Cleveland. He introduced Murray as his running mate this morning. Murray is well known here in the Cincinnati area from her time on city council. She said she and Renacci have been talking about teaming up for a couple of months. Renacci has owned several businesses, including a car dealership that he lost when GM was bailed out in 2009. He's also aligned himself with President Trump, saying he's the only candidate for governor who supported him from day one. The reason you don't know me is because I'm not part of the problem. I'm not a career politician. I'm not the guy who's been around the state for years and years and years. I was so honored to be asked to be Lieutenant Governor of Ohio because I want this to be a state where kids and families want to stay, where everyone can have a job and where we are safe and we can raise our families and we can retire. Renacci and Murray will challenge Attorney General Mike DeWine and his running mate John Husted in next year's Republican primary. Current Lieutenant Governor Mary Taylor is also running, and she's planning a stop here in Cincinnati on Wednesday. Paula. Thanks, Anjanette. And seven Democrats are running in the May primary for their party's nomination. They include Ohio Supreme Court Justice Bill O'Neill, former State Representative Connie Pillich, former Congresswoman Betty Sutton, and Dayton Mayor Nan Whaley. Former State Attorney General Richard Cordray announced his run last week.